With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, the question is, how are the elements with variable valency named? Explain with an example. So in this question, we have to show how are the elements with variable valency named and also explain this term with an example. Clear? So let's start. The combining power combining power or combining capacity of an atom of an atom or an element is called its valency right now valency of an element is decided by the number of most shell electrons if an element if an element exhibits more than more than one valency then this is known as variable valency clear so if an element if an element exhibits two different positive valences then positive valencies then for the lower valency for the lower valency we use the suffix o u s at the end of the name of the metal right and for higher valency higher valency we use the suffix ic at the end of the name of the metal clear now coming to the example so iron is a metal that exhibits different valencies different valencies it exhibits plus 2 and plus 3 valencies right now the number of electrons in iron are 26 so like other metals it has two electrons in the 4s orbital and four electrons in the 4d orbital fine it loses two electrons loses two electrons from 4s orbital to attain to attain stability 
making its valency as valency as plus 2 clear now in the d orbital which is more stable which is more stable and it loses and it loses another electron from the d orbital and making valency as valency as plus 3 clear so we can say that fe2 plus will be ferrous ion or we can say that in ferrous state and fe3 plus that is ferric ion or ferric state so therefore iron exhibits ferrous state and ferric state clear so this is the solution thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today